If you were at Carson Park this afternoon, you most likely heard plenty of music, singing, and celebration. Those sounds were all coming from Eau Claire's Juneteenth event, a time that attendees say is all about coming together as a community. These are people who value inclusion and love and you feel it out here. On June 19, 1865, the official announcement of the abolition of slavery reached Galveston, Texas, a day we now know as Juneteenth. This is the, America's first step towards really having liberty and justice for all. So this is important to talk about freedom and citizenship and to be in a country where your citizenship is not linked to your ethnicity. For the past 21 years, a Juneteenth celebration has been held in Eau Claire. Apart from 2020, when the pandemic caused the annual in-person event to be replaced with a full schedule of virtual educational workshops. A year later, the in-person celebration has returned and brought with it the spark of community. This is just such a wonderful celebration event that we have um, to bring together the diverse community that we do have um, in Eau Claire here. And I think so many people are really appreciating being physically together in this space, um, especially after the last year. With several hundred people in attendance on Saturday, that feeling of community also brought the feeling of hope. Juneteenth is what cleans out the wound that has been festering for 150 years. And this history is what's going to bring us together. And this service is what brings us together. And this is our first step really to taking back the divisions that this country has had. Juneteenth is gonna bring us together.